Hi guys, Master Indigo here. So as Killer Tony requested, I am now making a video how to install the mod and actually install pretty much every mod which uses BLT and the mod overrides. So first off, I linked the mod itself and the BLT. So first on, go to the mod page on last bullet. I'm not sure if you need to be logged in. If you do need to be logged in, just click here, login through Steam. If not, it's not needed probably. So get down here and press download. It downloads a zip file. You probably have a 7 chip installed or WinRAR or something like that. You should be. If not, just Google WinRAR and download the free version. It works fine. To make use of this mod you also need BLT. So let's go to the paydaymods.com and let's see if it's right here I guess. Payday 2 BLT tab, yeah and scroll down to the download button. Download that. It takes a while to open. I see. Okay, yeah, it's not a big file. It's basically just code. So yeah, now we have two files. Two GIF files, I guess. Yeah. First thing you wanna do is go to Steam. Right click on Payday 2. Properties local files and pros local files. If your Steam is set to different language it should be on the same place. Payday 2, the bottom one, middle one, local files and the first one, pros local files. And then it takes you to the folder where your game is in installed. For the purpose of this video I'm going to in show how, you do it, how to install it in a different Payday 2 folder. So here is the folder. It's exactly the same, but it doesn't already have the four mods. Okay, so except that file is a mod. So yeah, first you have now downloaded those mods. Those are probably inside your download location, wherever that is. So open your downloads folder and open the Payday 2 folder at the same time, side to side or wha however you want to do it. You can extract them to folders or just open them. It's pretty much the same. The first off you need to do is install the BLT. So just open the file, copy both the files and drop them to the Payday 2 directory. And that's it. You are now allowed to use BLT mods. It's really that simple. And the another one is called Mod Overrides, which is the modding system over overkill added to support modding. So first off, you go to the Assets folder and create a new folder called Mod underscore underscore Overrides. Overrides. That's it, I guess. Let's check Assets slash Mod Overrides. Yeah, that's it. So after you have done that, you are good, good to use uh, mod overrides mod as well. So now you can install the NATO mod. So as it as it states here on the page, move the Nevertales Arms Rage Tech Overhaul to BLT mod folder, which is PD2 slats mod. Here, don't delete these files, they are necessary for it to work. So open up the NATO and this file folder goes here. That's it. Leave it there. Now open assets slash move overrides and as said stated here, move NATO folder into the mod overrides. I have it opened here, NATO folder there, and that's it. That's all you have to do. And now you have access the NATO mod and you are able to install other mods as well. When you download a BLT mod, just open mods folder and unzip the file and place a folder here. It's pretty damn easy. When uh, you are using mod override mod, open up assets mod override mod and place the file here. So 
yeah, that's it. How to install the mod? It's quite simple. This tutorial does not show how you to install .pd mod files because NATO doesn't use it, but I guess I could someday use a video where a mod is using that system. So I'll show you how to use that then. But anyway, that's how to use modding system in Payday 2 and after that you can delete the original files from the download directory no need for those but if you want to delete the mods just go to the directory and just delete the file folder and if you wanna see some more just comment below anyway this was Master Indigo. See you later.